Ben's wishes. A girl who had an uncle who wrote books for children that lived in Africa. When the uncle came to visit her, he always told her a story. Her favorite story was Ben's wishes. He told her one winter when she was about uh, when she was about ten. It was about a um, kid who had two older brothers that often got angry and often felt hungry. Every day, his brothers told him to go and work in the fields to, uh, and make them a vegetable soup for their dinner. One cold morning, Ben uh, found a silver cup in the fields when he was digging. He sat under a tree and uh, said, uh, said to the cup, I'd like, I, la I'm so lucky to have five little olives, but I'd like a lovely warm drink. Suddenly, the cup was full of hot chocolate. Then, Ben asked for a new coat. Then, from, um, suddenly, a warm and soft coat came from the sky. Then, he had one of uh, a, a book who belonged to his brothers. He told the cup, I'm so lucky to have a book, but I'd like 100 more to learn all about the world. Then, Ben and the cup carried all the books to, um, carried all the books home. Then, Ben sat down by the fire and read them all. When his brothers came home, they were angry and said, Where's our vegetable soup? Ben said to them that he found a cup that can understand about wishes. And, and he said, uh, he told them to ask for their vegetable soup. Uh, themselves. Then one brother pick, uh, picked up the cup and uh, uh, said to the cup, "Give us, give me a room full of money." Suddenly, the, uh, there was money everywhere. Then the other brother t told the cup, "Give me a room uh, full of candy and more." money than my brother. There was money and candy everywhere. The two brothers started fighting. Then the cup fell on the ground and broke. All the money, the candy, the books, uh, Ben's warm coat, they all disappeared. But the cup couldn't make all the stories about the world disappear from Ben's head. So, when Ben was a, a grown-up, he uh, explored the world and wrote, la and wrote lots of um, er and wrote lots of books. But the girl never knew um, never knew her uncle's name. Perhaps, just perhaps, it was Ben. Goodbye.